Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am truly zonked. YouTube, how are you now? Good and you? Not so bad. <laughs> okay, whatever. Some of you might get that, some of you don't. Uh, okay, so we are back in my playthrough of S Spirits of Amazonia. And when we left off in the previous episode, we were checking our trust level. And we were at 710. We have 90 points to go. Uh, before we can ask the tribal elder for help. Uh, I don't know if the, the tribes people who were murdered in the trees or the children are pre-spawned um, in a fixed amount or if they spawn randomly. Um, yeah, it's going to take a lot more gameplay to try and figure that out. Uh, so... We really need to be focusing on finding the rest of the paintings and completing some of these Legends quests. We tried completing one, and turns out that, at least for some people, uh, the, uh, which one? The water or something. Uh, where was it? Oh, cursed water. This one, at least for some people, is bugged. You have to place a fire underneath a shrine, and it doesn't work. It doesn't allow you to place the uh, the item. So this one is just stopped dead and I think I'm not sure that completing these are a hundred trust each. I, I'm i not sure. Um, it's just what was suggested by uh, Juliardi that uh, the quest could be a hundred points. At least one of them. Anyways, so what we're going to do is I have been through these caves quite a bit you can see here and you can see the markers where I found the uh, the paintings and yeah. there's definitely quite a few more hold on let's let's take a quick look not the map give me the notebook so I have to find one two three four five six six more paintings <sighs> they are hidden well. So I'm going to get going. Let me just check my health. Oops. Hold on. Thank you. I uh, could use a little bit of water. What have I got in my pack for food? I could use some fresh orange mushrooms. I got 40, 40, and 40. I got one piece of cooked meat. What time is it? It's 3.30. Okay. Let me do a little bit of hunting here to just get a uh, just a little bit of foraging. Hold on. Oh! I think I see one of our, uh, paintings. Um, part of me wants to try jumping that, but I have tried extra high jumps into water before, and it has not worked out. Um, I might try that another day. <laughs> I'm reminded of Bard's Leap in Skyrim. <laughs> yeah, except the only ghost I'll see is probably my own. <laughs> Let's see if we can get down there. Oh crap, I got food cooking. Alright, alright. We're gonna... Let me, let me replan this a little bit here, so let me, let me see something. So... If I'm at this log, and I'm facing the village that is northwest. Okay, we're going to revisit that in, uh, in the morning. Alright, in the meantime, let me continue my foraging here. Okay, I'm mostly ready to go here. Let me just, uh, take some blue mushrooms for the ride. Okay, let's go see, I gotta get southeast. Let's go see if we can get to that painting we just spotted. Yep. 
Where was it? There it is. We're going to get up here. There we go. Ooh. They went looking for it every sunny morning, but never found it. Okay, hold on a second. So... Ah, I thought this was the last one I needed for this. Okay. Um... Game of Trust of the Village. Follow the legend to find and restore what was stolen. Yeah, that's the one we can't complete because of the bug. Okay. Moving forward. <coughs> ah, crap. The I have is dried. Uh, let's see what I can do. Don't stack, huh? That's too bad. Looking for Quasia. Oh my god! I am batting a thousand this morning. <laughs> he didn't poison me. stand to find one of my camps. Oh, you know what I should do? I should look in this mushroom, or er, in this cave for some mushrooms. But knowing this game, it's when you need a specific resource that it becomes very elusive. Yep, nope, nothing here. Huh. Yep, and we will goose our energy. Ah, oh, crap. Yes, eating an anti-parasitic <clears throat> food item. <clears throat> Sorry, excuse me. While dirty, you do still have a chance of getting parasites. It seems that when you have parasites and you eat anti-parasitic food, it applies the anti-parasitic aspect first. Oh good, I got a quasia right here. Nice! Okay, let's go wash. Uh, what I was saying though, is um it applies the anti parasite first so depending on how many parasites you have it you know will take care of them and then after it applies that effect then it tests to see if you have a chance of contracting parasites you follow my logic there so we'll go over it again some other time um, okay. Let me see what I've got done here so far. Time? It's only 9 o'clock and we're already half wiped out. Yeah, I really wanted to hang on to those mushrooms for later, but... Gotta get my energy back up. And... Oh, crap. You know something? I left my food cooking at the village. It's gonna be burnt crisps now. Oh, well. Let me see, can I make a fresh piece of bone armor? No, not right now. Okay. 
Continuing on. I was going toward the east. Oh crap, I need water. Ugh. Hold on. Something's happened here. I'm stuck. Okay. I can't jump. I can't move. My keys work. But something's hosed up. I gotta reload. That was weird. I drank water and suddenly my guy became immobilized. That must have been a hell of a parasite. No, bad idea. Mm -mm. <laughs> well, that was good luck. Let me resave. Continuing. <sighs> ah! Fuck off me! I am just not paying attention this morning. Crap, now I'm fevered again. Damn it, almost did it again. Oh man, oh good, I need these right now. Eat. Okay. Those anti fever mushrooms are dehydrating. One more. Just top up that thirst. Oh, I didn't even get sick. Any parasites. Nice. Time. It's like 12.30. Alright, I gotta run into one of my camps around here somewhere. I could be passing out soon. Alright, you know something? We're just gonna make a bet on the ground. Okay, that'll do for now. Now let's see if I can pay better attention. up there. I don't know if that I've ever been in that. Okay. There's two of my bowls I've left behind. Let me double check where I am. 36, 31. 36, 31. Okay. Let me slap together a basic camp here. I seem to have topped out, or at least it's taking, I can't seem to get armor above 95% right now, which is perfectly good stuff, but um, not what I expected to happen. Yeah. I can't seem to make anything higher than 95% right now. I will 
continue making them. But, uh... Seems like there's a point of diminishing returns, unless my, my crafting skill needs to get higher. What is my crafting skill? 40 out of 100. Which I've never really needed that high of a crafting skill. Things seem to always get better on their own. And uh, I think uh, maybe the crafting skill just defines how much you actually improve per craft. I don't know. I'm just thinking out loud here right now. Let me see. Let's uh, get ourselves back in our way somehow. All right. I'm trying to see how I can get into that cave there. Uh, I've got an opening right here. Have I been up here? Oh, apparently not, because it just gave me a map entry. Oh, come on, guy. Seriously, dude? Okay, well, that was a, a letdown. Another one. Shit. I'm lucky he didn't get me on the way up. Okay. Here's one thing I'm going to do really quickly here. Um, I just saw a turtle. I could stand to improve my skills somewhat. So I'm going to do a little grinding. With both spears and arrows, the thing is, uh, my obsidian spears, I don't want them to rot by sitting on the ground. So uh, let me just slap together a weapon rack really quickly here. Alright, I'm going to... Put my obsidian spears away for the moment. Still got 33% on this tribal bow. Alright, we'll, we'll save it. Even though it might not be that great condition anymore. And... What I'm going to need to do... Is... Take a handful of long sticks with me to make... Um, weak spears for grinding. Let me save this. Let me uh, craft a couple weak spears. That'll do for now. And I th think I left some meat burning on a fire. Oh, it's going on midnight. Let's go to sleep here. Let's see. I went to bed with some leeches. Or leech, singular. Let's go wash up. Okay. Six thirty one, so we're up here. Let me I think I've pretty much covered these caves. Let's work our way around this north wall. Oh, what's our uh, archery skill up to? Fifty seven. Uh, I would have liked more, but it was taking a long time. Blades is maxed out. Right on. <gasps> Unbelievable! Oh. Wait, 
Yeah, all those fever mushrooms are gone. Wait, where am I? 37.29. That's more north than this map does. Well, that's interesting. Alright, here's one. Whoa. God, I've been poisoned so much today. <laughs> okay, which one have we got? No hope for peace. Deal with the evil spirit. The howling spirit. It's a story about an evil spirit. It sleeps in a tree. It howls when the wind wakes it. Its yells sound like a hundred dead monkeys whose spirits are still in, the, in pain. No animal or human would go near it. The few that did met a terrible fate. Their remains are guarded by the evil spirit. No hope for peace. Alrighty. So... All right, we've got something to actually do here. Um, hold on, let me double check something. Um, deal with the evil spirit from the legend. So, now I'm just thinking out loud here, but uh, that could go one of two ways, because there really hasn't been any supernatural element to this game so far. Superstitious, maybe, but not supernatural. So... Um, and I, I'm down with a little supernatural, you know, a little, a little spooks and ghosts in the uh, the forest. Yeah, you know, not zombies. I don't like zombies. Zombies are boring. Um, but ghosts, yeah, yeah. So um, let's see. Let's double check our map. Now, okay, here it is. So we learned that when you find all the pieces of a legend you get a question mark icon that indicates where to go. This one here is for the water spirit that we can't, or cursed water, excuse me, that we can't complete because it's bugged. And we just got a new question mark here for uh, for this one. So, all right, let's see. We are at, come on, 4030. 4030, okay. So we're here, we're going to go, Southwest. That way. <laughs> uh, Alright. I thought that was a little too high. <laughs> Just because. <laughs> This must be the spot. Let's check our location here. 4435. 4435. That's gotta be about it. But, what do I do? Is there any interaction with any of these? Is 
that you? There you are. <laughs> Shit! Son of a bitch. Of course, my quassia dried out. He can't brew dried quassia. Perfect. Gotta do it to myself again. So, I thought at first it was something to do with that pile of skeletons. Except there didn't seem to be any way to interact with them. Yeah, there's the bone pile. It is... Let's look at the legend again. It's a story about an evil spirit. It sleeps in a tree. Ah, okay. It howls when the wind wakes it. Its yell sounds like a hundred dead monkeys whose spirits are still in pain. No animal or human would go near it. The few that did met a terrible fate. The remains are guarded by the evil spirit. No hope for peace. The remains are guarded by the evil spirit. So, okay, that must be... It sleeps in a tree. All right. Let's get back down there again. Damn it. Oh man, I'm just wrecking myself here. Okay. Their, their remains are guarded by the spirit, and it sleeps in a tree. It wakes when the wind howls? It howls when the wind wakes it. No animal or human, the few that did, no hope for peace. Um, there's no real wind in this game, though. <laughs> you son of a... Damn it! <sighs> Glad I keep my armor topped up. Okay, I broke down. I looked it up. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I can only walk around in circles for so many times, and honestly, um, yeah, I would have gone on for a significant amount of time. So apparently i got to get up to that bridge for starters. Reaching your car, crossing the Bramboo Bridge just west of the marker. Jump through the rocks until you reach a tall edge by the marked tree. What marked tree? So even looking this up, I'm not, <laughs> not really... <laughs> um, jump through the rocks. So you get to the tall edge by the marked tree. Just like that, the evil spirit was defeated. <laughs> oh, that's rich. There's a bicycle lodged up in this tree. The howling spirit. When the wind blows, it howls. A sound like a thousand dead monkeys in pain. Um, it must be a rusty wheel spinning. But, 
I don't see the marking he was talking about. Okay. And there's a final step to completing this. I've got a lot of fat I'm going to have to trim out of this video. The last step is to... Urgh. Yeah, I gotta go east to the village and tell the tribal elder, hey, we're gonna get something done. East, east. You know something? Just because. Okay. And the final step is to exaggerate your results to the elder. Hey, bud. Okay, well, there's not much of an exaggeration. No options there. You did good. Now we can bury the dead. Oh, interesting. 100 trust. All right. I, I'm, I'm going to stop right there for the moment. This has been a very long play here to try and get this. Uh, hopefully, I whittle this down to a manageable video and uh, get the salient parts into it for you. And um, I want to thank you for joining me. Please like and subscribe. Uh, it would mean a lot to me. It doesn't cost anything, like they say. Um, and in the meantime, stay healthy and take care.